Good, beautiful stinking morning today. Look at this weather. Going to the swap meet right now. As you can see, Ricky's behind me, Jay the Generous is behind me, and also Roscoe Soul Train is over there. Let's hunt. There, there he is, everybody. Mr. Ross, wow, you're like one of those cool kids from Ticker Talkers. <laughs> oh gosh, uh, I hate everything I just saw. <laughs> Dude, oh. Look at this, man. Look at this, California Narcotic Officers Association. <laughs> oh my gosh. How I is, can't put it on. What, what is that? Is that? Oh, you can't. It's really oh, it's like a dog run. <laughs> Ricky, Ricky, Ricky's finding something. Some games, Ricky? How much of the games? 50 for Super Mario World. 25 for our type. I don't know, Ricky. Um, I mean, so it seems like his prices are like right on. Yeah, 20, big price charts. 40, 50. Which if you need them is good. But, and then these are 10 each. But look at what I found on the start button on this one. Oh, no. You ain't pausing the game if you got those ones. So turn of events, I actually ended up picking them up, but I got them down to $15 each for these. Nothing crazy, not a crazy good deal. I got to kind of clean them up, but 15 each isn't a bad deal either. So worth taking it. When you see the games, buy the games. It's the first thing in the morning and we're already starting. All right, so are they all a buck, all the DVDs? They're all a buck? All a buck. All a buck. Sick. Look at this one says Roscoe. This one says Roscoe. For, for, for Roscoe? <laughs> Grease for a buck? I mean, why not? How much? Five bucks. Five bucks? A yellow submarine guy? He said two bucks on this. Ricky, you gonna pick up that one? Yep. Game gear? What you got? What you got? Go for it. Go for it. Oh no, not that. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> That's the only one I wanted. No. How about the speed racer guy? Three bucks? I guess I'll take both of them. Oh, Ricky. Ricky. Are you looking at a sealed Hot Wheel? Are you gonna get it? I might. Dude, it's, it looks vintage. If you don't, I'm getting that, because that's rad. No, it's not, it's a, it's a game, bro. I, I know, I know, that's why it makes it cooler. It's like a PC thing. I can already see it now. Hot! Yep. What was that? Ricky. Ricky. I'm gonna quickly show everything I got as I throw it in. Come over here, Roscoe, sir. All right, so I got some VHS's, I got the amazing Gargoyles movie. I've been wanting this for a long time, I'm not kidding. This is empty, but only two bucks for the box, beautiful. Godzilla, amazing. Purple Rain, we all know. I showed most of the VHS's, I'll skip those. But, PC version of Galaxy. I actually really enjoyed this game. I used to play it on the PlayStation. This is the PC version of it. We got two turtles right here, and we got Austin Powers with stinking mini. One million dollars. <laughs> and we got a couple uh, speed racers. I got two of these just for a few bucks each. Uh, awesome Game Boy bag. You know I love me some bags. And lastly, five dollars for a PS3 DualShock controller. Yo, Ricky, <laughs> that's awesome, dude. So you put your stuff in it, dude? That's I what know. it's for. It's a shelf. Show me. It's dope. Look at that. Yo, holy moly, that's awesome. Oh, it's ten. Wow, are you gonna buy that? Hey Boogie, how much you asking on the Batman thing? Dude, this guy Ricky is officially buying this beautiful Batman shelf set piece. It's beautiful. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it, but you know, I, I could say Story no. of our collecting life. <laughs> but over the past decade, the face of addiction has transformed dramatically. Yo, this is sick. A Mars Attacks toy. <laughs> That's awesome. How much is this guy? 20 bucks? He's cool. The Martian Spy Girl from Mars Attacks. I have not seen anything Mars Attacks in a long time. I don't even think since I've been doing this I've seen Mars Attacks stuff. Ricky and I stumbled across the coolest set of pops that I have. And, and, and we are by far not pops people. But I'll tell you what we are is freaking tombstone Tomb people. Wyatt, Virgil, Morgan, Doc. Best mustache go. That's gotta be Wyatt, It's dude. gotta be Wyatt. It's, it's gotta be Wyatt. It's There's like a thousand tombstone quotes, so leave your favorite tombstone quote down below. These are cool, so how much is all this Atari stuff, just out of curiosity? How much for all this? Just out of I don't even know if I... 300 for everything. 300 for everything. It's original box. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's cool stuff. I, like I said, I don't know enough about it. Except this is rad. This Spy Hunter right here looks awesome. I love Spy Hunter on the Nintendo. This is great. <laughs> Jay shows up with this. How much did you get this for? Uh, 
60. Wow, it's primitive too, man. Yeah. These are clean ventures too. Wow, dude. Good for you. Look at the grip. Yay. Look at this board. It's primitive. Look. So this has been a great morning to the point where we even haven't even had time to like stop and like chit chat because every booth we're finding stuff. It, it never ceases to amaze me how much we find at the swap. It's unreal. That ET is beautiful, Ricky. How much for the Super Nintendo games? Uh, how much? Uh, any of them? Twenty-five. Twenty. I know. Twenty. Forty-five. Forty-five. How about Zelda? Forty. Forty on Zelda. We got Rampage, Command and Conquer, Gex Three. So there's some definitely good titles. So there's some great VHSs over here. By the way, Roscoe and I were literally like pushing each other. Like I walked there and we're like fast pacing. This is the coolest one I saw right here. Mummy's Alive. Mummy's Alive was so cool. Such like a non-talked about cartoon. Well, I guess a lot of people do, but. Roscoe, how did I not see that? Oh, on the that. edge of the table was just sitting. You're the only one here without a Marlboro bag, by the way. I know. Did I get one? Even our buddy Chris has one. I mean, you're... Yeah, I, I feel like I should get one. <laughs> it's actually a nice one, though, to be honest. I know. Look at the tags. So, new with tags. Look at this homeless guy right here. <laughs> this is, again, again, why I love the swap meet. We got Chris, we got Blake, we got Roscoe, we got Mort, and we got Ricky. The Marlboro bag. The Marlboro crew, bro. I love it. <laughs> I love it. So, so far here, I'm gonna pick up this for 20 bucks. Ricky picked up this buzz. And it's clearly the special Ricky edition. Made for me. What the heck is this guy saying? Hi ho, Kermit the Frog. Rubber ducky. Oh, it's so cute. All right, guys, listen, I'm calling it now. I'm gonna ask Dusty, and if he does, I'm calling it. I'm gonna see if he still has that WCW, NWO, N64 shirt. Sure, if he does, I will pay him $100 right now for right. it if he, right. right. if he still has it if he still has it he already sold the shirt that's that's my fault i got caught slipping you got the shirt yeah i got a shirt too don't worry i'll get him roscoe just on the edge of the table are you getting it bro i don't know i'm gonna see how much i want for ask him bro ask him for the bag five roscoe or do you want gang teams i like that i know i, I need do. you i kind of like that i'll trade you for the PlayStation yeah. thing. <laughs> this is like one of the coolest. So I always run across these 1984 LA Olympics hats, but I've never seen one like this. What do you call these? Like a newsboy type? Kind of like one. a newsy hat. Yeah. And Ross, I know you you like this kind of this stuff too. Great, yeah. It's all you, but I, I wish I threw it to you better. That's okay. I love it. And then Ricky just found a Call of Duty Black Ops 3 hat. But I think the Carl Jr. thing makes it cooler. I it makes it, it gives up a little. I like when multiple brands mix. That's true. You know it what I mean? Cooler. Heads up, Ricky ended up not getting this, and I did. I thought it was cool. Ricky just picked up something Two for bucks. how much? Two bucks. Two dollars. Super Mario Bros. Nintendo DS. That case is clean. You know what else was really clean? What? The manual on that thing. She. <laughs> At the last booth, right underneath Retro Games Plus, Chris and Blake Snows, I got a black GameCube compatible Wii. Has all the plugins and everything. Check it out, Ricky. And I got it for 20 bucks. But you know, you know how Wii's, it's gonna work. I'm gonna send Chris a text for working, and I'm gonna send him probably Mario Party 8 coming out of it, because you know how that goes. So, Chris, we call, we're gonna start calling him Slippery Slope Chris. And now, an editorial from Slippery Slope Guy. What'd you find, Ricky? Talk Girl. The Talk Girl from Homer Aloner, part two E. But for the Wienian, which- Win. Oh, it has Ooh. the thing. All right, Ricky just got an absolutely epic score. I don't want to say anything, but he got it for 30 bucks. An original Talk Girl. Blake's jealous, I can tell right here. <laughs> it works, and one of the coolest part is the cassette inside this has actual recordings from a little girl back in the day, which I love that kind of stuff where you can hear like the original user using the stuff. That is super cool, Ricky. Look at Blake over quality here. Quality on it is probably so awesome. It really is awesome, dude. What'd you find over here? The uh, Nintendo Mini. Let's see it. You got a Nintendo Classic, a Mini. Look at that controller though. What is this controller? And oh, it's a wireless one from my arcade. Look, it's right here. But either way, Ricky, very cool, man. All right, Ricky, real talk now, though. You just got that for 20 bucks. That's an easy $100. Dude. Easy. And I'm not going to lie, I was literally just bragging to Chris and Blake. I'm like, I'm telling you guys, we find stuff every row, every minute. And then right when I said that, I looked, I turned around, I'm like, Ricky's holding NES Classic. 
Yeah. What'd you pick up? Oh, scorpions. Depeche, Depeche mode. mode. Culture, Culture Club? Club? Yeah. Dang, you're cool, bro. You're cool. And then I got Night of the Living Dead Hollywood Classics Collector's Edition, but I thought it was unique because it is sealed. So, took a chance on it. We'll see. Pretty cool either way. Look at that face, though. I'm boss up here. Ricky, what'd you buy? Got these from Maverick, my, my little boy. Those are cool. Actually, so Hobbyanas, I was telling Ricky, is actually a good brand. Ooh. That's the brand of sandals that my wife wears. Not the Mario ones, though. There's definitely some games in here. We'll see, I'll come back. I wish you guys would have seen that. Ricky just snaked me. No, I, it's okay. He, I, told, I literally told him to dig in. What's, what's in there, Ricky? We, we resort and... And we sports? No way. Sports. Wow, you just robbed me. This is a prime example uh, what we were saying, we filmed saying, look at this bin, it looks like a bunch of junk. This was in there. We ended up paying five, and there's probably, what, 40 bucks of value in here at least? 45. About 45 bucks of value, right there. Just like that, easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Ricky just came to pick up his Batman sign, and then he got a partying gift. Another Genesis off-brand controller. High frequency? That's sick, that was kinda cool. Never seen this out lying around in the wild. NFL 2K Dreamcast Strategy Guide oh, with the poster. If it was anything but sports, I would be all about it. What a fantastic day, non-stop finds today. It was like boom, 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 boom. No matter how many times people say it, Ricky, it the good. swap meet is not dead. It's not dead. It's not dead. <laughs> <laughs> For my son!